dressing avocado green onion so it's lemon juice chives basil and garlic now we have our second bag some butter lettuce I actually seen these i never tried them i actually like plantain banana chips but these are the jerk style so they have some seasoning in it my roommate grabbed some banana chips so these are more sweeter than the plantain chips some limones the garlic powder aguacates we also picked up some canned beans. These were just the organic grade northern beans. For seasoning, we have organic oregano. We have some black, what is it? black garlic. Picked up the watermelon facial mist. She said that she had really good reviews about it. So I went ahead and picked up one for myself. So I'm super excited. They had a rose one, but it had fragrance on it. You don't want to have you know, your skincare to have fragrance. It's not good for your skin. And also some avocado oil healthy alternative than just using vegetable oil okay now for our third bag i'll tell you guys this is like a big grocery haul hopefully like so we have some strawberries because we love some strawberries of course we eat this with like our oatmeal making like smoothies in the morning grab some grape tomatoes Así cuando quiero hacer una ensalada o pasta, lo voy a agregar tomate. also have some these are sweet figs. Yeah, sweet figs. Never tried them. Like my roommate actually grabbed these. Aquí tenemos el larguísimo receipt. But honestly, that I think about it, it wasn't really that bad because we did get a lot of healthy. Well, honestly, everything in these bags are healthy, and I feel like at other grocery stores it would have been way more expensive. We have another one of the mini cucumbers. These are really good. We try them with like tahini and limon. Delicious. We have another one of these sweet figs. I should have grabbed these. My roommate put me on. They're hikama wraps. They're thinly sliced hikama. So they're great for like tacos. Then we have two of the corn tortillas. Which 
Trader Joe's. And we also have two bags of cold flour. And we have some plant-based hot dogs. I did not know there was plant-based hot dogs. So hopefully these are actually delicious. Now for our fourth bag, we have some non-dairy oat creamer. This is perfect for my morning coffee, especially whenever I have a early client. Love taking that. We have some coconut whip. What is it? Whip topping. We also have some grapefruit juice. Next, we have the organic coconut smoothie blended with young coconut bean with coconut water. Some vegetables to fry. This one actually has zucchini sparrow. And we got three bags of the chicken, less mandarin, orange juice. So hopefully these are actually very good. My roommate said she had these before and she said they were really good. Next, we have the roasted corn. We have some hash browns. These hash browns from Trader Joe's are so good. And of course, our main source of protein, we have our tofu. I've never had tofu in my entire life, so I am kind of scared if what if I don't like tofu, but I'm going to have to like it because we're doing this journey. Um, this is organic tofu. It does have how many grams? It has eight grams of protein. So I'm super excited. Hopefully, see si sabe bien. My roommate said you have to season it, of course. Now on to our fifth bag. Oh my god, I love these chips. If y'all seen my Trader Joe's haul last time, I did film a video for you guys. These chips are so good for you. These are actually like a healthy alternative than the Takis ones because the ingredients. So these are the tortilla chips, chili and limes, and they're so good. Also, I have watched like these YouTube like Trader Joe's hauls, and people say get the vegan banana bread with walnuts. So I'm super excited to try some almond butter filled pretzel nuggets. And Trader Joe's to the power of vitamin C is organic, 100% juice blended. It's technically a blend of organic orange, pineapple, mango, lemon juice with organic acerola cherry powder, vitamin C. So it has mango, mango too. This is how it looks like. And we have here the organic carrot turmeric juice blend. It's a flavorful twist to carrot juice with lemon juice and added spice. Super excited to try this. Of course, make sure you're drinking your natural juices every day. Also, I never tried this before, but I think I've seen it like on TikTok. So it's technically a blueberry lavender flavored almond beverage. A smooth and creamy on dairy beverage. So hopefully it's good. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about the lavender. But we'll find out whenever I make my coffee. And then we have the Pinch Mago Scented Foaming Hands Soap. Actually, I'm obsessed with their candles. They have the peach one. It smells so good. Now for our sixth bag, we have spicy Mexican rice cauliflower with tomatoes, tricolor bell peppers, and jalapenos. This actually really looks really good. So I'm actually excited to try that. I'm assuming we're going to pair this with the tacos and the tacos. Also, I am filming this journey for you guys, so I will have a separate video like me making the food and actually trying it for you. Next, we have the rice cauliflower stir fry. I'm going to try this. So this is the vegan meatless meat eater pizza. So it's full loaded plant-based pizza made with meatless pepperoni style slices, meatless Italian sausage style crumbles, meatless chorizo sausage style crumbles, and meat vegan mozzarella style treats. So hopefully this pizza is actually really good. Never had it. I don't. Whenever I do, I will tell you guys if it is good or not. I actually love pickles, and recently this TikTok thing has been going viral where like comen el pickles con chamoy and like chips, and it's, it looks so good. So we got some fresh pickles. You can never go wrong with some pickles. If you do go to Trader Joe's, you know these ice cream cones are like very like known in Trader Joe's, but I have like the alternative, which is the vegan one. So it is mini coconut non-dairy frozen dessert and like i did mention to you guys i've had vegan burgers before and i actually like them so this time we have high protein of course because i will be i will be going to the gym throughout this journey though i mean because i told you the gym is my lifestyle now so i do need high protein food so we have some high protein veggie burgers from trader joe's it actually has it has 26 grams of protein, which is really good. Our seventh bag. We have two bags of baked spinach. We have some plum pots. Those Korean spicy stir fried rice cakes. This actually looks really good. Next, we have some Korean mushrooms. I love chorizo. Of course, I was born and raised by Mexican parents. We would always eat huevo con chorizo, like frijol, and be 
delicioso, especially if you eat it like in a taco or burrito form. But this is soy chorizo, so this is vegan and gluten free. I'm actually really excited to see how good this is. And of course, whenever you want to eat a bagel, we have some vegan cream cheese. Next, we have a plant-based vegan buffalo-style dip. We have next the organic vegan nacho dip dairy-free. And I didn't know this actually existed, but it's simply eggless, egg-free, commercial-free, cruelty-free. So like, what? It's huevo, pero no es huevo. Like what? Somebody please tell me why, how, how does this work? So I've actually seen like a lot of people take these and I wanted to take them myself. So we have here three of these little bottles. I'm pretty sure you've seen these before. So we have the Organic Mighty Turmeric Juice Shot, a blend of coconut water, turmeric, and lemon juice with added black pepper. I know these are not good at all. They're actually pretty nasty, I've heard, but they're good for your guts, you know, your health. So this one is the Organic No Joke Ginger Juice Shot with a blend of coconut water, ginger, lemon juice, with added cayenne. Oh my god, I'm, I'm not excited to try these, but like I am kind of, but not really. This one is the Suja Organic Vitamin D and Zinc Shop with Rich Probiotic. Probiotics, no sé cómo decirlo, pero me entienden, verdad? And yeah, I'm not really excited to try these, but I know they're good for you, so. Oh, la belleza cuesta, verdad? Next, we have some blueberries, of course. We're gonna make some overnight oats or like oatmeal in the morning. This is what I'm actually excited for. My room is really good. It's the Cologne Coffee Oatmeal Double Latte Creamy and Balance. I'm actually gonna take one right now because I do have some. I do have two clients, and after that, I will be going to church. I still have to get ready and all that, so I do need some coffee. So I'm excited to try this. Okay, that is actually really good. Last but not least, we have our last bag. This is our eighth bag. I know this is a big grocery haul. Again, of course, had to pick up another two bags because two of them are my roommates, two of them are mine. Because these are so good, y'all. Y'all are missing out if y'all have not tried these for kids. We have some organic lemon. Next, I have some vegan bol bolognese style pasta sauce with tomatoes and English plant based crumbles. Super excited to try this for my with my pasta. Next, we have some golden potatoes. You can never grow on some potatoes. Some raw whole cashews. Now, this is the sauce that we're using for the tofu. This is organic smoky barbecue flavored coconut aminos seasoning sauce. So this was gonna be the main source of flavor for the tofu. Last but not least, we have some vegetable broth. I can never go wrong with some vegetable broth. I'm super excited for this drink, y'all. It's a very like different lifestyle and it's like a new era in my life. But I am only doing this for like, I will say three weeks. Yeah, it's three weeks. Um, I'm gonna see, I'm going to see if I go in for like, um, go for a month for it. But this is just something for me to like test my waters. I hope no like actual vegans get offended at me saying like, oh, I'm gonna be a vegan for like, a month or three weeks. Not really be becoming vegan, but be doing like a plant based, I guess, diet. Because I know, like, I am Mexican, so I was raised eating always carne, greasy food, so it's always important for you to take care of your gut health. And I feel like this is a good way for me to like start and like test my waters and like changing my actual eating. And I feel like this is a great way to start. So I'll see you guys later.